Okay, today we are at Buckstar. Let's see what it is about. Hi. Hello. Hi. Welcome to Buckstar Beer and Growl Swap. So that is, tell us about Buckstar. So Buckstar is about very pure beer. We use organic malt, no added sugars or syrups. It's unfiltered, it's unfined. It's as pure as you can find it and it's brewed using solar energy. That's awesome. And why do you call it a Buckstar? Bucks, Bucks is short for but Buckinghamshire and Milton Keynes is in Bucks, so we are Buckstar. Oh wow, that's very thoughtful. And what's this whole concept about this growler swap which everyone is talking about? So growler swap is about fresh artisan drinks. Uh, it's basically a zero waste scheme. So we, we're avoiding single use containers. Uh, we avoid recycling because of its high carbon footprint. And we avoid uh, refills because of various problems associated with refilling uh, containers. So Groundless Hop is basically the future of drinks. So that is, why should I buy your beer and not pick one from the supermarket? Why should I come all the way here to get mine? Well, this is far better quality. Uh, it may have a shorter shelf life, but that's the nature of a, a pure product that hasn't been adulterated. Uh, it's unfiltered, it's unfined, it's unpasteurized, the carbonation is natural, uh, there are no added sugars or syrups. So all the goodness is basically kept in the beer. We don't take it out. Right, that's interesting. So what is the formula behind it? Like, do you do it like a, a way different from others? Um, well, it's obviously very different from something that's mass produced um, because it's not doesn't go through the same processing as uh, mass produced products. Uh, therefore, the shelf life is a lot shorter. Uh, it's handmade and the quality is better. So it's more, it's more designed around the consumer rather than the manufacturer. Right, so can, can we say that your each brew is unique? Um, kind of, kind of. I mean, we, we try to be consistent as possible, so we rely on our skills to make sure the outcome of the product is as close as possible to what it should be every time. So customers, uh, their expectations are always the same. When they open the product, they can taste something that's pure, fresh and tasty. Right. So, and also, preaching is one thing and practicing is another thing. So, how you justify what you're preaching? Like, you say that you want to save plant here, but how you're doing it through your business? How you're different from the other corporates who have... Um, well, we invest in our we invest in our growlers. They are expensive uh, glass containers. Uh, we swallow part of the price. Uh, we don't make any money on the containers. Um, and we hope that customers will come back because they like the product as well. So uh, I personally, I always use whatever I drink. If it's beer or anything else, I use reusable containers. Um, so I practice what I preach. Um, we're committed to the environment. That's where we're investing. Um, so if you as a consumer are committed to the environment, you would make the effort to bring your empty and, and swap as well. Right. So if I come to Milton Keynes, what are the places where I can go and get my growler swap? At the moment, uh, you can come directly to the brewery. Uh, we have a home delivery service as well around Milton Keynes. Uh, and there's a frost scar the center in Woburn uh, that permanently stock it. And we are now looking at building up uh, outlets so that customers uh, have a convenient location they can go to, take their empties and swap it. That's awesome. We wish you all the best for your business. Thank you. 